let us look at a uh, next example where let v be a vector space for all function f from r to r which of the following set of functions are subspace of v where a is a function f such that f of x square is equal to f of x whole square b is a function such that f of 0 is equal to f of 1 c is a function such that f of 3 is equal to 1 plus f of minus 5 d is a function such that f of minus 1 is equal to 0 and e is a function which are continuous so we will wait for 5 minutes and then we can look into the solution Uh, let us look at the solution so the question a the function f such that f of x square is equal to f of x whole square does not form a subspace let f of x is equal to x g of x is equal to x square then f of x square is equal to f of x whole square g of x square is equal to x square whole square which is nothing but g of x whole square but f plus g of x is equal to x plus x square f plus g of x square is equal to x square plus x power 4 while f plus g of x whole square is equal to x plus x square whole square which is nothing but x power 4 plus 2x cube plus x square since f plus g of x square is not equal to is not equal to f plus g of x whole square the condition does not hold and this is not a subspace now let us look at question b this does form subspace here let c be an element in r suppose f and g satisfy the property then c times f plus g of 0 is equal to c times f of 0 plus g of 0 which is equals to f of 1 plus g of 1 which is equals to c f plus g of 1 so thus this constitute this function constitute a subspace let us look at question c 
this does not form a subspace. Here, let f of x be a function defined by f of 3 is equal to 1 and f of x is equal to 0 for all x not equal to 3. Let g of x be a function defined by g of minus 5 is equal to 0 and g of x is equal to 1 for all x not equal to 5 then both f and g satisfy the condition but f plus g of 3 is equal to f of 3 plus g of 3 which is equals to 1 plus 1 that is 2 while 1 plus f plus g of minus 5 this is equals to 1 plus f of minus 5 plus g of minus 5 this is equals to 1 plus 0 plus 0 that is 1 since 1 is not equal to 2 f plus g does not satisfy the condition now let us look at question d it does form a subspace suppose f and g satisfy the property and let c be an element in r then c f plus g of minus 1 is equal to c f of minus 1 plus g of minus 1 that is c of 0 plus 0 which is equals to 0 thus c f plus g of minus 1 is equal to 0 therefore the set of all functions constitute a subspace and last question yes uh, this is also a subspace let f and g be a continuous function in r to r and let c be an element in r we know that sum and product of continuous function is continuous and since c is also continuous it follows that c f plus g is also continuous and thus set of all such functions constitute a subspace